In this case study, we are going to explore how predictive analytics can effectively combat the spread of disinformation. In 2019, Sudan's military ousted its dictator president, Omar al-Bashir, who was in power for nearly 30 years. A transitional government, which had been appointed to prepare the country for elections, asked Valent Projects to help them understand and address the disinformation threats they were facing. Valent Projects deployed Newswhip Spike, so they would have a precise understanding of the stories and information spreading in Sudan. It ended up proving key when it came to monitoring disinformation in the country. Through their online monitoring, Valent saw ongoing attempts by malicious actors to stake tensions between different factions within Sudan and actively monitored them. The intensity of these efforts kept escalating until one day Valent Projects discovered a Facebook post shared across a network of rogue pages suggesting that an armed conflict was about to erupt in the capital city. The post was then followed up by a video that claimed to show violent fighting about to break out. The video, actually an old clip from previous year's conflict in Khartoum, was being used to try and manufacture conflict in the streets. Valent Projects could see in real time that the video was gaining traction based on volume and velocity of engagement and interactions. And using Newswhip's predictive intelligence, they could see that the post was predicted to go viral in the hours ahead. This was a genuine risk that could trigger the Sudanese army and other factions into mobilization and that a fiction could become a reality. Valent Projects immediately shared the predictive analytics with the prime minister's office, who in turn shared it with the transitional government and the Sudanese army. Seeing the data and how big this story was becoming, all the actors realized how serious the situation was. They issued statements reassuring the public that no actual conflict was occurring on the streets and stopped the narrative in its tracks. Valent Projects and their government clients watched as the engagement with the disinformation campaign slowed and finally stopped. Valent also shared the evidence with Meta, who responded by removing over 60 fake Facebook pages involved in the disinformation campaign, and then continued to monitor and remove fake pages and accounts. While the situation in Sudan remains volatile, this case study demonstrates the transformational impact predictive data can have when combined with human intelligence. Contact us today to learn how you can benefit from Newswhip's predictive data.